what's going on welcome back to the channel rookie riches where all we do is hustle and find new ways to make money on the street saying online you know what you're looking at today i'm a go buff delivery driver man you know it's one of my little side hustles dog you know gotta have more than one ways to eat man i'm getting a late start to the day man i got there and always wasn't answering the uh, doorbell so I end up parking around the corner, you know, I had to take care of my thing. I'm about to go ahead and wash my hands, you know what I'm saying? But well, I already hit them with the hand sanitizer, you know, just a little sanitizer they give you for free at Gold Pub. Yeah, no perks to the job, free sanitizer, what can I say? But yeah, man, I'm about to pull up right here. You know, my shift 6 to 12 tonight, I only work three days this week. You know, today, tomorrow, and then I come back in on Sunday. We're going to see how it go, how much money we can make tonight. You know, it's six drivers on, man. They said they just changed the policy. Like, I guess we, we 30 minutes or less now, and not 45 minutes or less. Well, it used to be an hour or less if you was an existing customer, but it was uh, 45 minutes or less if you was a newbie. Now, the, now everybody just got, they want the orders delivered in 30 minutes, you know, so 30 minutes or less, like the movie. We're going to see what happened tonight, man. Hopefully, we can get in here and pile it up tonight, make some good money in these three days. You know, I'm gonna do an update at 8 o'clock, let y'all know where that bread at. But document the grind, document the hustle, man. We're gonna see if it's puffing tonight. What's going on? Welcome back to the 7 o'clock update, man. You know, I've been on the clock for an hour now, man. It ain't really puffing like that, man. We got six drivers on, though, plus me make seven drivers. But, man, I was only able to do one delivery in this past hour, man. But $9.25. You know, luckily I got a little $6 tip on that one order that I did. I made the 325 for the delivery charge, but you know, that's all man. And I got the uh <laughs> six dollar tip for 925, man. After one hour, you know, I got the uh today I ain't got no audio book playing yet. I'm listening to uh different ways to learn how to invest money, man. Like I'm listening to Dave Ramsey right now. You know, he got a bunch of books on investing in stocks and real estate and things like that. But I'm listening to a couple of his little uh little excerpts that he got on uh YouTube, you know, about how to diversify your portfolio. And I just listened to this video by uh, Ryan Scribner. It's about how to become a millionaire on $5 a day. It's like a 30 year plan. Basically, people spend $5 on everything, anything in a day. You know, he's basically saying if you can put that up a month, it's $150 every month. Do that over a span of 30 years, you know, with the compound interest, you know, investing into the SP 500 index funds. Be a millionaire in 30 years but you know that's the people that's like young i'm like damn what if i triple that and invest in 25 dollars a day you know could i do it in half the time <laughs> you know but not to get off topic man this stuff i'll be on man for real building growing man got to build and grow but yeah man we had nine dollars and 25 cent for one delivery i got a delivery right here that i'm about to drop off and just go like update you get back on y'all in an hour let y'all know what's going on with that money What's going on? Welcome back to the 8 o'clock update, man. Man, it ain't puffing at all, man. It ain't puffing at all, man. It's it's so slow. And that last, when I did the last update at 7 o'clock, oh, too much sanitizer. I had, uh, I had did one delivery for $9.25. Got a $6 tip, luckily, to make that $9.25. You know, in this past hour, man, I only did one. One one delivery died for uh twelve dollars and fifty cents. So I'm at two deliveries for twelve fifty in two hours, man. But like if you follow my vlog, uh GoPuff do give the drivers a subsidy of eight dollars and fifty cent, you know, for like hours like this where it's slow. So it's like I made seventeen dollars this hour, you know, because if not I'd only made six twenty five per hour without that subsidy. But that's good they give you, you know, a little Set, set rate of pay just for when it is slow like this. Like I said, it's a lot of drivers on here right now. But yeah, man, we had 1250. You know, I did find an audio book to listen to. I'm listening to uh, the neuropsychology of self discipline right now. I forgot the author name. I have it when I come back on on the nine o'clock update. But he just made a statement. He said, find you role models that uh that do things that you already want to do. Like he just mentioned George S. Patton from World War II. He said he modeled this whole battle strategy after um, Alexander the Great, you know, and his whole philosophies of war and all that he got from Alexander the Great. Then he said Alexander the Great got his uh, philosophy and like mindset from her, from the uh, Greek god Hercules, you know, 
It's like it just go like to show the chain of, you know, uh, uh, command. Like people like he took from Hercules, he took from Alexander the Great, and ain't no telling how many people took from George S. Patton's strategy. You know, he was considered to be like, you know, you know the biggest, uh, the biggest threat in that World War II. You know, if you uh, hit to the World War II, I know a little bit about World War II history, but he was like one of the biggest reasons we won that war. But uh, yeah, man, not to get off topic, man, we had 1250, man, but you know, it's all about finding some role models doing things that you want to do. Like I'm trying to get in this online business and, and also form other businesses and stuff. So I got to start following people like Grant Cardone and Warren Buffett and, you know, just watching them and reading the material and things like that. And they get in you and get in your soul, man. Like anything you're trying to model yourself to be after, you know, you know, find people to find people to follow, you know. That, that really are into it, like whether you play basketball or invest in stocks or real estate, you know, whatever it is, finding a role model, you know, or finding a mentor to help you through the process always going to make it easier. But, yeah, man, not to get off topic, man, it ain't puffing right now. Two hours in, without that subsidy, we only had twelve fifty. but luckily GoPuff pay that subsidy. We had $17 in two hours. I'm going to do another update in hours. What's going on? Welcome back to the nine o'clock update. You know, when I gave that last update, man, I was at real bad, sad fish sandwich, man, off Popeyes, man. You know, the real bad out here, man. I was at uh, two deliveries for twelve fifty. But like I told you, GoPub do give you a little subsidy, so I was at seventeen dollars after two hours. You know, the subsidy that they gave you, I only made twelve fifty, but they put that extra uh, four fifty on there to make sure I make eight fifty an hour. But anyway, in this past hour, man, I did three deliveries, man. It's picking up a little bit. You know, from nine to about two be the money hours, for real. That's what I noticed, man. I say that a lot, but that's that's what be happening, man. But uh, I did five deliveries on the night. Put me at $40.25, you know. Got a little bump in pay. I think I'm a little over $13 hour, probably about $13.41 or something like that. You know, Dookie House with that math, man. I'm coming over the top with the numbers. But uh, yeah, man. Thirteen dollars. Nah, you know, got a little bump in pay. I still got three more hours to go. I think it's still gonna be a hundred dollar night. You know, even though it did start out real slow, I've been thinking about changing my shift from seven to twelve instead of six to twelve. Cause I've been noticing that six to twelve. I mean, that six to seven hour don't really be doing a lot of orders. It varied though, but the last few times I worked, I really been doing a lot of hours. I made a lot of orders in them hours during that time frame. But you know, I still got the book plan, man. The neuropsychology and self-discipline, you know. Trying to get back to my disciplines, man. You know, I, man, I lost all my discipline. I'm back drinking that yak, I'm back drinking that, back smoking that tobacco, man, you know. Back eating meat, man, even though I know I'm about to get rid of all of them for life, especially the meat and the alcohol, man, but the meat and tobacco, I might still drink a sip of champagne or wine on celebration or something like that. But uh, can't be an everyday thing no more, man. It's all about breaking habits, man, and, and disciplining myself, man, and to make myself the better person, the best person that I can be, you know. You can't try to be nobody else. You can only be your best you. And I just want to see my best me. I, I don't feel like I've seen that, man. You know? And that's what I'm chasing myself. I ain't chasing nobody. I'm chasing myself to be the best me that I can be, you know. But uh, yeah, man, discipline, man. Discipline always outweighs talent. You know, you can have talent, but if you don't have the discipline to keep doing what's going to improve your talents, your, your talent's going to fade. You know, so I, I believe discipline is important to everything we do in life, man. But uh, I don't be trying to get off topic, man. But you know, it's just the Puffy Chronicles, man. I'll just be talking, man. It's a slow day, so I'm going to chop it up. But uh, yeah, man, we have forty dollars twenty-five cent after three hours. We'll see what we can do in these next three hours, man. Five orders for forty twenty-five. What we have right now. What's going on? Welcome back to that ten o'clock update, man. Hey, I ain't even in reverse. But when I did that last update, man, I was at uh forty dollars. I think I was at forty dollars and twenty-five cent, man. You yeah, know. Making about thirteen forty one an hour, you know, nighttime drivers. So I got some new ones, man. I had to go get these, man. I had the broke ones, man, that I ran over if you follow my vlog. But uh anyway, you know, I was at forty dollars. We making about thirteen forty one an hour. And this last hour I only did one delivery, man. One 
been like two hours, two or three hours tonight, man, with one delivery, dog. That ain't getting it done. But I'm at $47 on 60, deliveries, 4750 on six deliveries, man. So, you know, after four hours, you're making almost $12 an hour because if it was $48, that would be $12 an hour. But, you know, we have a minimum wage, man. But this ain't, it ain't, this ain't the puff I know, man. But, uh, like I said, man, school out now. So, our order numbers been way down, you know. A lot of our orders do come on campus. I'm actually out here by campus right now, you know. But right now, 47.50, dog, I ain't get it done. Can't wait to school and get back in. That's why, that's another reason I cut my days down to, you know, the, uh, like two or three days a week. You know, because, you know, I just know, just doing this over a year, I kind of know what time and what times a year we going to get the most orders and all that. Because I've been doing this a little over a year now, you know. I think in December, it'll be two years. You know, will it? Yeah, December it will be two years, you know. But January it'll definitely be two years. But yeah, man. Got the uh still got the neuropsychology and self-discipline plan, man, you know. Gotta hypnotize myself back to this discipline, man. Get my discipline back together, dog. But I was talking to another GoPuff driver in another city. He was like, man, GoPuff, sorry here, man. I ain't, he ain't had a fifty dollar night yet. I was like, damn. You know, he got to stay consistent though, but he did, he might be going through the same thing I'm going through with. You know, just being slow with school ain't in and things like that, you know. We up here with Western Michigan University, man. It's like 50,000 people go there, so they leave the city. A lot of money leave, <laughs> you know, for real. But, man, now to get off topic, I'm going to do another update at 11 o'clock. Right now we at 47.50, man. You know, trying to get this discipline back together, man. What's going on? Welcome back to that 11 o'clock update, man. You know, when I did that last update, I was at six deliveries, yeah, six deliveries, forty-seven fifty. You know, making about close to twelve dollars an hour, man. You know, not too bad, not too shabby, little under twelve. But you know, in this last hour, I was able to do three more deliveries, put me at nine on the night, only one delivery away from getting that forty-dollar bonus, and I'm at sixty-four dollars and twenty-five cents, I believe. You know, making about twelve eighty five an hour. We got a little raise because I think we was a little under twelve when I did that last update. You know, still got my book plan, man. About my discipline. You know, tomorrow I'm starting everything over. I'm, uh, I'm thinking of starting another channel, just to uh, like a challenge channel. Like uh, tomorrow I'm starting everything over. No need. No tobacco, no alcohol. My mission is no poison in my body for 30 days. That's what I'm going after. Uh, yeah, man, I'm trying to go 30 days, man. No poison in my body, man. Straight purging, man. No gambling, no nothing. Just getting rid of all addictive habits, behaviors, substances, everything, man. Challenge thyself, man. Always be challenging yourself to build and grow, man, for real. You know, that's what I'm be about, man, for real. The older you get, the more you be looking at time, you just wasted doing nothing, absolutely nothing, you know, for real. Like, all the money you wasted and everything, man, you know, I'm starting to take all that into consideration, man. You know, that's why I'm, I, I like, I love when I drive. I don't care if it's slow or not, man. You know, I'll just be, I'll just be chilling, man. I'm good, man. Not to get off topic, man. We had 1285, just, just a puffy chronicle, man. But, you know, I got to give y'all a piece of me, man. You know, you don't like the show, change the channel, man. <laughs> but man, I'm gonna get back on y'all in an hour on the way to the crib, man. Hopefully, we can at least clear $100 tonight. You know, we're gonna see what's going on. Welcome back to the 12 o'clock update, man. You know, when I did that last update, man, I was at uh, nine deliveries for $64.25, making about, about 12, 12 something an hour, man. You know, since then, man, I only did another two deliveries, man. My night over with, I'm on my way home, you know. But I did 11 deliveries for 77 75 You know, came out to like a little over $12 an hour. Something like that, I believe I did the math right. Might have been a little bit more, not too much more though. But, you know, it was a slow night, man, 11 deliveries. But I did crack that. You know, that 10 order bonus to get that $40. I mean, to get that $40 bonus. I did 10 orders tonight. So, you know, if I don't work, if I didn't work another night this week, 
I would still get 117 off the check, man, for one day. So can't beat it. It's almost, you know, almost twenty dollars an hour. You know, for six hours of my time, not too much, not too bad. You know, but yeah, man, getting back to that discipline tomorrow, man. Got to get up tonight when I go home. I'm gonna write out my day tomorrow, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna live it to the T. You know, that's one thing I'm about to start doing is planning my day, and I'm gonna start planning my weeks, my months. Then you get to if you can plan your year, that's that's amazing. But you know, everything deviate because you got other people that you know depend on you when you take care of and you know so you can get deviations but i'm gonna stick to it as close as i can but tomorrow or tonight when i go home i'll puff puff on some of this moon rock and i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna write my plan out man for the for tomorrow and i'm gonna live it like it's a movie script you know gotta get some order back to my life man you know slipped up a little bit got a little out of control man you know the weather got nice and i forgot what was going on man. <laughs> you know in the cold man when ain't nobody out here and ain't, ain't as much movement man it'd be so easy to stick to what you're doing on your own you know when you got a lot, a lot of movement you have people out people barbecues and you know you can get real distracted from what what you're really trying to do man but you got to make yourself do it you know so I'm getting back to that tomorrow. Doing 30 days, no poisons, man. You know, time to do the challenge with me, man. No alcohol. No, no alcohol. No meat. No tobacco, man. For all the smokers out there, I'm smoking a hard habit to quit, man. I've been smoking my kids, man, their whole life, man. <laughs> They've been asking me since they was could talk, man. Then he quit smoking. It. I'm still be, you know, I done took breaks and things like that, but I ain't never just quit all the weight. Now I just want to quit all the way. I don't know. I've been wanting to quit all the way, but I never tried to stand on it and do it. But I'm getting to it tomorrow. You know, I'm pray on it tonight. And I'm going to get up like, let's go. But yeah, man, not to hold y'all up. It's the Puffy Chronicles, man. Only did 11 deliveries tonight. I do work tomorrow and I do work Sunday. So I should be at at least crack the 40 orders to get that $100 bonus. You know, that's what I really be trying to crack. You know, not do too much. At least I, you know, I only need about four, five hundred a, a week out of out of this hustle. You know, two, three hundred a week. I want other hustle. Two, three hundred a week. I that hustle. You know, but man, document the grind. Document the hustle, man. This been another one for the books, man. Peace and love, help and wisdom, man. Stay puffing, stay hustling, get your money.